Ladies and gentlemen, I'm Spurgus and welcome back to the Groundbreaker here in the outer world. So let's go get wasted. Uh, Pavadi wants to go get wasted, so we'll do that. Do we get a table? Stand in a corner? Okay, so what are we drinking? You're the expert. How about some vodka? Oh, and don't worry some about vodka. I got this. And let's some vodka. Do it proper. So that's just to get the shit faced. You see, now it doesn't matter. Mm, start slow with beer. Nah. I start with beer. Mm. There you go. If you really want to get drunk, whiskey is sufficient. I'm drunk's what I'm aiming for, <laughs> so I'll take your word on it. Bottoms up. Didn't think you had it in you. I'm impressed. <laughs> oh, no, it's good. I'm, I'm fine. I just didn't expect it to taste like... Oh, propellant. Oh, stars, I can feel it settling. Oh, Captain. I'm pining for June like something fierce. What am I doing? Um... Whining. <laughs> no, we're going on a grand adventure across Halcyon! You're funny. Yeah, I guess we're doing that, aren't we? Crewing together, seeing the stars. It's like something out of a serial. I like the ones with grand romances. And I think... I think I'm flubbing mine. I don't know what to do about... us. Beats me, I have a rough track record with the relationship. <laughs> you and me both, Captain. I'm just... She brought up another lady, you know? Isabel. Why would she do that? Maybe I've been making a right fool of myself this whole time. Maybe she's not interested after all. Maybe you're overthinking it. Or maybe... Hmm. What you actually write in the message? You never said. It was real long and rambly. She was telling me a story about her dad, how a lady named Isabel did all sorts of things to try to win his favor. This Isabel lady never quite managed to get her dad's approval, but they carried on anyways. Made something good out of a bad situation. Then it all went down the tubes. Do you think June Lay still has feelings for her? This is really a bad woman. I just got a lot of feelings, Captain, and they're all climbing up my throat. I, I need another drink. Right now. Before I lose my nerve. Let's get some water. What? Are you... Same as before. No more whiskey. I think another would leave me on the floor. Yeah, that's the point of it. It's beer time. We had beer in the veil. Smelled like dad's old socks. Maybe this is better? Probably not, no. Down it goes. Oh, no. No, it's it's still bad. It's still really very bad. Oh. Oh, Captain. I want to talk to Junlei all the time. Even about silly things, but... I'm so scared. But what about me? It's always about me. Me, me, me. Everybody is thinking about themselves only. You know that everybody's so selfish. Only I am thinking about my myself. Wait a minute. You're swell, Captain. Don't get me wrong. I like spending time with you, going on adventures and all, but that ain't the same as as romance. Does she think I'm as pretty as I think she's handsome? What if she doesn't like me? What if she does? What if she's still got feelings for that lady, Isabel? What if we we get together and she gets bored of me? Well, then you get untogether. <laughs> Fuck if I know I'm just here for the booze. <laughs> well, thank you for the conversating, Captain. I got a lot to think about now. Not the least of which is how whiskey's the devil. <sighs> Let's get going then. I'm sure we got lots of important things to do. So, what next? Alright. 
Back to the ship then. No problem. Okay. So. Didn't I request no more fertilizer ship? Shut Wait, up. Captain. I hope I wasn't too much bother at the bar. I did have fun. And I tried some things I never would have otherwise. Oh, that whiskey to give my headache and something. Well, that's what alcohol normally does. It like a primal's chewing on my skull. Make you do some things you wouldn't normally do. All right, so did you did you talk to Junlei? I messaged Junlei when we got back, and she replied super quick. <clears throat> okay. I was awake half the night thinking about what I sent, anxious to see what you said. I reread my message in the morning, and it was unclear. I was drinking when I sent it. Otherwise, I wouldn't have had the courage. Also, sorry for the typos. <laughs> Were there any funny typos? Oh, she called mashed potatoes smashed potatoes. But I think maybe that's just what they call them on Groundbreaker. No, no. I've she wants to smash your potato. Because I didn't say things I should have, like, I've met someone who's become special to me. I want to be honest with her, so if she feels the same about me, there won't be any surprises. Wait, is she talking about you? I got to read between the lines a bit, but I think she might be. Yeah, I ought to go write her back. I mean, I already did. Twice. <laughs> but anyhow, thanks for taking me out, Captain. <laughs> yeah, sure. So what next? Quest complete. What? Okay. What the fuck do we have? What? We have woolly cows in here. I gotta say, I'm very much surprised. Mm. Okay. Um, up here. Let's give Sam a little thing here. Initiating initialization sequences. Greetings, customer. This Sam unit is unable to locate your registered information. Would you like to <laughs> register your Sam? Sam! Of course! Registering new owner, Captain. Welcome to the crew, Sam! Sam units live to clean and clean to live. Issuing sanitation ticket, error. Good work, Sam! Thank you. Customer, this area is utterly filthy. <laughs> Where did you come from, All buddy? Sam units travel fully assembled in a 12 by 12 corrugated steel box. Amazing! I mean, wait, wait. I want to know more about you. Did you know Sam units are capable of equipping regulation-grade flamethrower nozzles? Upgrade your attachment today and get to firing away. Thank you, Sam! You want to help me clean up the colony? Not stubborn stains. Leave them for Sam! Sam! Alright, Sam! Sam... No, he's not... He's not? Oh, it doesn't matter. We got skill points. Um, let's get them in here. There you go for yay for engineering. Um, anybody wants to talk to us or something? Vicky boy. I could spend, so no. No. All right, Sam.
Ah, pues claro. Hmm. Wait a minute, what? Oh, look, Sam is actually some guy we can take with us. But we're not going to take him with us just yet. So look at that. They want us to go in here. We can do that. Hello. Just yank the drive and I'll do the rest. Now that we have the data cartridge, I can finally find out where that scholar I'm looking for ended up. Come on, boy. Got it. His name is Reginald Cheney, and he joined a sublight salvage crew. Only he's not listed on the return manifest. Must have made landfall somewhere he wasn't supposed to. Ah, uh, yes. Here. There's a domicile on Monarch in Fallbrook. Rented to the same bit cart he used to buy his seat on the salvage ship. I should have guessed. What better place to lay low if you wish to avoid the authorities? You hesitated here, Vicar. What aren't you telling me? Oh, it's nothing. I suppose I really didn't have much faith in actually finding him. Of course, that's wasn't the reason. It was a long shot, wasn't it? All right. I admit it was a bit of a long. Hey, J Lo. We interrupt your speak your mind. Honestly, I could use the distraction. Do you want to talk to no, no, nothing. Damn it. Groundbreakers. I don't know, he seems really smart. Oh, I'm sure he puts Um, whatever. Milady? If this is something to buy. Shit. Welcome back to. Hmm. Okay. Well, because I want to find out. Because I want to find out. Get in here, guys. Come on. Okay. That is a bit strange, but all right. Hmm. Okay, we'll see. We'll see. I, I did save before I went here. So here's the seal. But that <coughs> thing in my jig is not here. That um, nav key. Hmm. Okay. Milo. Milo. Damn it, Milo. Ah, it's good enough. Brown Groundbreaker is now confused. The last few was good, but they're making uh, lots of mistakes with it later. Yeah, well.
All right. Um. Okay. Okay. No, I'm not gonna kill you. I'm a nice person. Okay. Let's 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 just run with it. Let's see what that means. We need to talk to Ada because somehow or I don't know. Um what's her name? She died. <laughs> it's the main quest, so there must be another way. To get it. Get it? I don't get it. Okay, Ada. Now, of course, we have to talk also to Lila or Lydia or whatever her name is again. Seven, I must confess, I have not been cleaned for far too long. You're sure this will... Oh, yes. That's the spot exactly. I, I, I... Why, I didn't expect <laughs> you to be so thorough. I am ashamed to admit. Oh, Captain, there you are. Pardon, but... Perhaps you could afford us some privacy, please? Um, soon. But I have some good and some bad news. Welcome back, Captain. Oh, no, it's only bad news. How can I be of assistance? Well, Gladys is kind of dead. <laughs> so what now? Activating contingency plan DM17. Captain is a psychopath. Please <laughs> use your travel terminal and venture to Monarch via the Cascadia landing pad. I should warn you, Captain. Cascadia is an incredibly hazardous location, rife with deadly fauna and flora. You will most likely die within three steps of the landing pad. Have fun. Thanks. I'll be here. So basically... Okay. Well, we still can talk to... to what's her name? Lydia. So... Or will that's alright. But I'm still confused about... But that's probably another quest then. Alright. Um, these items here. Beauty basket, beauty basket, beauty basket. Real strange shit, but alright. Lilia. Make this conversation worth my time, Captain. No, wait. Wait, what? Yeah. Huh? So it's kind of broken. Salvage of this guy. Hello. If this is something. So this is broken. Talk. Oh, that's not cool. Hmm. Well, I have this seal. It's a bit strange, people. It's a bit strange. I don't like it. Did you break the game? I don't... It can't be, no. Nah, I don't think so. Hey, buddy. How do you do? I'm doing fine. Huh. How am I? Oh my law. You've done it. You've saved my hide. I can't thank you enough. Now then, uh, let me see. I just have to apply the seal here. Sign like so, and... Ta-da! <laughs> here are the forms you'll need once you reach Byzantium. Oh, and a nav key, so your ship can travel there. Those authorization forms will let you speak with Sophia when you arrive. I'll send her a message straight away to let her know you're coming. She'll be delighted, I'm sure. Here's Sophia. Captain, are you telling me you haven't heard of the adjutant to the chairman of the board? No. Ms. Akande may just be the most powerful woman in the colony. Oh my. Yes, quite. Ms. Akande is just the person to take someone with your particular talents and sterling character under her wing. 
She can fill you in on all of the board's operations in the colony. Really put your talents to use. Good. Thank you. Best of luck to you. Better. Hmm. I never thought I would see the gates of Byzantium. Never mind what lies beyond. Wow. Byzantium. I guess that'll be pretty crowded. Tariff. No. Okay, maybe maybe Lila, Lilia. Wants to talk to us now. You weren't followed, were Son of a bitch. Okay. Let's just see. We'll do the main quest now. We're gonna go to to Monarch. Dangerous landing pad. Hmm. Well, that's the only way we can do it right now, so. Message from Dr. Wells. We'd like to congratulate you on finding a route to Monarch. Doesn't this guy have a life? I don't believe so, Captain. Transmission incoming. <laughs> Cascadia? I don't know if you're extraordinarily brave or slightly suicidal, but Cascadia is one of the most dangerous places in Monarch. Please be careful out there. You'll need to speak with Hiram Blythe. He's known as the information broker, and for good reason. If anyone knows where I can find those chemicals, it's Hiram. I need those chemicals to revive the Hope's colonists. They can help us fight back against the board. They can help us set things right. If we don't put a stop to the board, they're going to drive this colony toward a complete societal collapse. You'll see what I mean when you arrive on Monarch. Just tell me what to do. You'll want to hire the services of a skilled guide. I recommend a hunter by the name of Nioka. Frequents the drinking establishments of Stellar Bay. Very hard to miss. Once you have everything you need, make your way to Hiram Blythe's compound. Come see me in my lab. Okay. Best Fuck you then. Captain, an unusual wavelength is coming through Monarch's aether wave frequencies. The eternal is in us all. The OSI would have you believe that your place in society, indeed in the universe, is preordained. A man who works in the mines of Hephaestus, coating his lungs in mercury dust for naught but a few bits a night. This fate is set in stone? When he dies young, coughing up black blood, his part in the grand plan? No, I say. Greatness is in everyone. Not just those so fortunate as to have been born into prosperity. That was unexpected and odd. What the fuck was that? Sounded like a bunch of nonsense. I am inclined to agree with your assessment. By which I mean I have been systemically programmed to do so. <laughs> Good. Now we have leveled up. Okay, but before we do so, um... A little nappy in our nappies would be fine, I guess. Mm -hmm. um, there you go. We're still thirsty? What did I drink? Bye, bye, bye. Okay, now. Oh, everybody else also get the perk points. The perky, perky, perk points. There you go. Yes, please. Hmm. You suck. Science open damage. We don't really use them.
Mm -hmm. Interesting. Intimidate goes up. I like that. <clears throat> Let's do some of that here. Thank you. A new perk point. That's the last one, right? Then we can go over here. Um, dialogue skills plus 10. Wait, what? No, no, back. All of them. Yeah, look at that. Wow, that's not bad. Not bad at all. Okay. No, oh, damn it, I didn't want to. Son of a bitch. Well, now we need to look at first what we got here. Stupid ass monarch. I didn't want to take Pravati with us, but... You have to go over there. What the fuck is this place? I don't think I like this place for a little bit. Let's go. Living is overrated anyway. Anger a man of the cloth. He died now, you little shits. It's goddamn little shits that killed Vicar now. Well, it's not too bad actually. I mean, look at it. We kind of killed them around here. I mean, they said it's too dangerous around here, but. Oh, what the fuck is this? Ah. I guess that's a dangerous one. Okay, man to queens. A bit of a bitch. Here 
Yeah, that does nothing. Son of a bitch. Don't. Well, I overdid it, but we almost had it. We almost had it. Hmm. Okay. So how are we going to do this now? But basically what we need to do is to run like little bitches. I mean, I'm pretty sure we could do, we could even do this if we had to. But <clears throat> I, I kind of feel like here against the wall. So, um, we, we can do this, I think, step by step. But right now, we're very, very much on our own here. Four. A clean lemon. F4 shows a clean lemon. And I don't know why. Mega Raptor done. Okay, fellas. We need to run. Run like hail. Bitches. Where are we right now? We're going the wrong direction. Doesn't matter. Another Mantic. Two Mantic Queens? What the hell? Ouch. Hello. How are we doing? And the Mantic Queen sleeping in there. Sure, why wouldn't it? We're burning. Sure, why wouldn't we? Oh, bye, bye, bye. The silver pits. Drug addiction. We don't have a drug addiction. We're not using any. Oh, yeah, we, we use a couple, but still. It's barely any. We don't really have a drug problem. Not yet, at least. What the fuck is this? Oh, a mega my. A fucking mega Manta Queen. And another Manta Queen over here. Sure. I thought like the Manta Queen was one of the bigger opponents, but no, I was wrong. It's just a regular one around here. Son of a bitch. So yeah, we cannot make it over here. We're way, way too low of a level at the moment. We need stronger weapons. Just need better stuff indeed. Okay, where are we? Okay, we're getting there. I'm not sure why Sam and Vicar Max are not getting attacked or something, but ah, Colossus, sure, why not? Okay, this place is weird. Hurry up. Stellar Bay. Nice. Hold on your hats, children. This ride is about oh. to get ugly. Deploying odor neutralizing. Oh. Aerosol spray now. We did it. <laughs> 
We made it to Monarch people. Mm. Or should I say Stellar Bay? So does it mean that we always have to walk back and forth like that? Or or can we just land somewhere in here? That'd be great. Something fishy. Find an alternate roach. Okay, this looks really strange. And I like how it looks like shit actually. Where is everybody? Oh, they're there. Wait. Hey, hold on there. I gotta sign you in. Where does the ship land? What the? Son of a bitch. Oh. The ship is up there. Or if it is somewhere, then it's up there. Okie dokie. So that's all. See, see, why all the hassle with all that stupid, like, paying 10,000 shits, man? Are you crazy? I'm not gonna pay 10,000 shits for that. You must be nuts, people. Nuts. Yeah, oh, boy. All right, fellas. We made it to Silibay <laughs> the hard way. Fine by me. I'll see you guys in the next episode when we're gonna explore Stella Bay. Thank you very much for watching. See you next time. Goodbye.